Hi, in this video we'll learn how to use the help function to get help on objects and their attributes. If you need help on a string method or on the int type in general, for example, you can use the built-in help function. You can use the help function without any arguments, like so, to enter the help utility. And here we have a general message with information on how to move around in the help utility. Now we can type, for example, keywords to get a list of all the keywords in Python. Now still in the help utility, we can, for example, find help on the del keyword. All we have to do is type del. And here we have it, the del statement. And here we have information on that statement. We can also check symbols. Here's a list of all the symbols that are available in Python. When we're done with that, we can leave the help utility by typing quit. And here we have the message. You're now leaving help and returning to the Python interpreter. So now we are back in our Python interpreter. You can get help not only within the help utility, you can also get help on any topic by passing it as a string to the help method. For example, if I need help on keywords, I can just type help keywords. And here is the list of keywords. If I need help on the del statement, all I have to do is type help del. And here I get an article on the del statement. If I need the list of symbols, I just type symbols. And here I get it. If I need help on a specific module, like for example the random module, all I have to do is pass the name of the module to the help function. So, help random. So here we have an article on the random module, which is quite lengthy, and usually it's not exactly what we need. Usually we need the information on just one method, and I'll show you how to check it in a moment. But first, let's see how to get help on the float type. Well, nothing easier than that. Help float. And here I get an article on the float type. Help in class float in module built-ins. If you need help on the built-in len function, you can just type the name of the function and you can pass the name of the function without quotes, like so. Help in built-in function len in module built-ins. Here we have the signature of the function, return the number of items in a container. And now if you need help on the split method, which is a string method, you can find help like so. Help str, which means string, split. And here we get help on the method split. If you need help on a specific topic, you can get the list of available topics like so. Help Topics And here we have a list of available topics. And now we can enter any name to get more help. For example, let's see we're interested in scoping. So all we have to do is pass scoping as an argument to the help function. Help Scoping. Yeah, and here we get help on scoping. As you can see, you can get quite a lot of information from the help function. Okay, that's it for this video. If you like it, a thumbs up would be great. Also, make sure to subscribe for future videos. If you want to leave a comment or ask a question, you're welcome to do so. Thanks for watching.